Aluminum is not ferromagnetic, so it's not attracted to this magnet. But when you move a magnet by it, it causes something called magnetic breaking. Notice how it's not hitting the magnet here, but it just slows down to a stop softly. This happens due to eddy currents that form in the aluminum that make magnetic fields that oppose the magnet. So the faster you move the magnet, the stronger the breaking force. To make extreme magnetic breaking, I can cool the aluminum down to reduce the resistance of the eddy currents, and also I can increase my magnetic force by using my giant thousand pound pool force neodymium magnet. When I drop it on the aluminum, it doesn't just slam to the table, it actually just softly lands on the aluminum. It's like there's this soft cushion it's landing on. <laughs> this is so awesome. To make extreme eddy currents that never stop, you can actually use a superconductor like this one. And the magnet just locks the superconductor in place. Look how cool that is. And since it's a type two superconductor, it even keeps its same orientation as I move it around the magnet. 